Two teenage brothers from Northwest Indiana have developed an app to help you keep those numbers down. Morning Insider Tim McNicholas shows us how it works. And then if we go to this page over here. Every app developer knows the phrase. It's right there. Necessity is the mother of invention. So if someone added Whole Foods. Jack and Sam Landmesser may want to recode that old saying. Their invention was born from their mother's necessity. Our mom would come home every day after shopping and she would discuss with her friends um, all the businesses she went to and what protocols they were taking. The 18 and 13 year old thought there should be a free app for that. So they got to work on their own. Safe Shopper, which was added to the Apple App Store last week. Shoppers can add businesses to the app and put a check next to the COVID-19 safety measures they're taking. Are grocery stores requiring masks? Are restaurants limiting customers? Are they wiping down tables? It's very important just to, I feel, just to try to help as many people as possible and to spread this information. Within a week, more than 300 people downloaded the app. I've used it a few times. Including Michelle Hunt, who is especially proud because she taught Sam in the fourth grade and especially grateful because she's mom to a five and one year old. I have older parents and um, they, they help us out a lot, um, especially if I go back to teaching, um, they babysit for us. So it's really important that we find things that are safe. She says she recently hopped on to warn people about lax rules at a local restaurant and saw someone else had already spread the word. The positive reviews are helpful too. Users have praised this grocery store on US 41. We have our story, we have uh, a contact us form. Sam and Jack even built a website where people can ask questions and learn more about the app, but the influx of users has already brought on some new challenges. Our servers uh, couldn't really handle all the support, so we've been working on it, trying to fix all the bugs we can. It's a good problem to have, I guess. It is. The brothers are now working on an even better version that will add a travel category for people trying to plan a safe trip and even though they live in Munster, they say anyone can use the app and add businesses in their neighborhoods. Tim McNicholas, CBS 2 News. Impressive, sort of like a Yelp for the coronavirus. The brothers tell us they're working with Apple right now to resolve a few kinks with their app so they can help more people. You can still download it in the App Store, but for the time being, they say there might be some connection issues because of all of their new users.